first came into a gym when I was seven years old, at Bradford Police Boys Club, and then I've pretty consistently been in the gym since my early 20s. I love the fitness side of it. I like fighting, you know, not in a bad way. I don't, I don't, I'm not a bully, I don't start fights, but I do enjoy fighting. It's in my nature, and I think any boxer does. Yeah. So basically, we'll follow them through here onto the bags. Doing this project isn't, you know, a priority for most people who'd be running a boxing club, but I want to do other things with this community club, and art is one of them. I think it's very powerful. Tool. Boxing is something that's really important to me, as is music. And they're often you know, sport and I think art are kept in very two separate categories. Just wanting to just bridge the gap between two things I love and give boxers a chance to be creative uh, and give musicians a chance to step into like, you know, a ring and create in that way. At first I was kind of like, how is this even going to work? We knew that we wanted the, the main elements to come from the boxers' movements. We didn't want us to like manipulate what was happening. We really wanted it to come from the boxers. We started by introducing a click track. So that's your like metronome. So that's going. Okay. Literally about like locking into the pulse and the rhythm and letting the boxers dictate the beat and the vibe of it. He was just hitting the bag and I was getting a feel for his tempo, I was getting a feel for his, his pace and just kind of taking that in as inspiration. You know, you hear the timing of the music and you just start to get into it and you're just thinking of new things, it just kind of comes off the cuff to you as you settle into it. We had to go through that process of marrying the rhythm to the boxer's movements. And whatever they came out with, so say it was like, uh, like one, two, left. It was like, okay, what would that be? Is that like... And locking that into the drum machine, then saying, okay, you've thrown that left hook. So what feels natural to you now? And it might be like, oh yeah, it might be like roll to the right and the right hands. Okay, so what's that? Is that like a hi-hat sound and then a big bass sound? And it was just that. Just felt like attaching sounds to movement. But eventually it started to happen. He started to get into his rhythm. He started to get into his flow. He started to feel the beat more and... Rhythm's everything in boxing. You know, even the counting when you're when you're trying to relax into doing shots. Sometimes people overthink things that they're doing. Say a simple combination, a one-two hook. And if so, but if you say that in your head, some people struggle with it. It's just the, oh, the movement and they're stiff. But if you say that one-two hook, one-two hook, one-two, it really just frees you up a little bit. It's kind of like a mantra or a trance. So yeah, I think rhythm is. Everything down to your punching, your head movement, your breathing, your blocking, your counting, it's all about rhythm. Rhythm is life, you get me? When you walk and you take steps, it's rhythm. Your heartbeat is rhythm. When we talk, it's rhythm. When we breathe, it's rhythm. I think the whole laws of the universe revolve around rhythm. Stan's rhythm improved. From the start, he was out of step and then by the end, he was finding the rhythm and getting exactly on the beat. And once you can get into a rhythm and kind of flow with a beat, you're not really thinking about being out of breath. You're not really thinking about how tiresome it is or how hard it is. 
you're in the rhythm. You know, you should have rhythm in what you do. You should try and break the other boxer's rhythm if you're fighting. Don't let them establish a rhythm. Break them up all the time and it, it's harder for them to do what they want to do. we're all creative I think all human beings are creative creativity is what it's all about a box is very creative especially like it's improvising it's thinking on the spot having another human being in front of you trying to punch you you have to be thinking then and there you can't go in and like I'm going to do this then I'm going to do this because anything can happen Mike Tyson said everyone's got a plan until they get punched in the mouth and that's the truth of it so improvising which is like jazz freestyling which is like hip-hop there's huge elements of creativity in boxing and rhythm is a cornerstone of it all. Moving into a rhythm. And what we're going to do, we're going to use your bodies and your movement to program in some drum patterns. Does that make sense? So we're boxing to this beat. This is what we're going to use. If you think it needs to go faster, if you think it needs to go slower, that's fine. It's completely Once you've got all of those elements together and you've got an opponent in front of you, it's about finding a creative way to make patterns out of all of those things that you've learned. I've been here for 15 years, uh, you know, one stage here, five nights a week. I'm not since Covid, we're three nights a week, but that's still an awful lot of my life. You know, my kids have grown up, that's all they've known. So when you push off that back foot, throw this shot. So go one, two, that's it, one. I've seen probably thousands of people go through here. I meet people who know me, talk to me, like, you know, when they're in the club. Some I remember, some I don't. 
you know there's just been that many faces and I know we've we've helped a lot of people and we've given a lot of joy to people. I think that's always been my philosophy. I'm big on community. If you can't establish a good community where you live, then what hope is there? And that's what this is. I always wanted that to be here. And it is, and for most of the people who come through here, they don't fight. We've had good squads and we've had national champions and that's great. But there's kids who it's probably helped more who have never had a fight for the club, but Maybe they've been bullied or maybe they just want to get out of the house or maybe the fitness has taken them on to feel good about themselves or there's a million and one reasons that it, it, it can help people. I did a white collar event and I lost. <laughs> I got knocked out. But before that, I always used to win. Do you get me? I've always won. And that's the first time that I got knocked out. And the reason why I got knocked out is because number one, I wasn't prepared. I didn't do enough training. I didn't do, I didn't give my all. I didn't do everything that I could have done. So now when I approach everything in life, I make sure that I give 100%. And since I've took that approach, I win and I keep winning. To 100 BPMs a human heart 60 BPMs with alpha brainwaves start Rhythms in the soul we check the pulse of the living Rocky said when life hits keep on moving Keep on pushing forward like Fraser slipping Rhythm is relentless, unforgiving Like an Archie Moore counterpunch Deep in your core like an ab punch Combat choreography, boxer beat brutality Metronome mentality, muscle memory musicality Training's got a tempo, fighting's got a flow When you're possessed by fatigue, you didn't know Ten seconds is so slow Power shots rock, hits you like a bass drop Thinking on the spot, freestyle, hip-hop Improvise, beat bop Glide out of mistakes, greatness you chase Gotta pick up the pace like drum and bass Meter is the master and cadence is the culture Got a rhythm and a reason to rise through the ropes Breaking down steps of a classical movement Breaking down steps of a fighter's movement Musical or physical, we're still rhythm student Composer or scrapper, we're still rhythm student Meter is the master and cadence is the culture Got a rhythm and a reason to rise through the ropes Breaking down steps of a classical movement Breaking down steps of a fighter's movement Musical or physical, we're still rhythm student Composer or scrapper, we're still rhythm student